What is up guys, Plant Commander here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pikmin 2. In the last episode, we explored some of the Bulblax Kingdom, and in this episode, we're gonna be doing more of that. Hopefully we can finish up this cave. It's been a couple days since I recorded, and uh, you guys probably are aware of that since I have a Mario Party series that's been going up. That could have been bad. I'm glad it wasn't. I'm assuming this is a treasure, so I'll have you guys dig this up. Ooh. Orange bulb orbs. Okay. What is this? Is this like a pine cone? What is that? I can't tell. It looks like a pine cone. Anxious sprout. Okay, I'm I'm gonna go under the assumption that it's a pine cone. That's the only treasure on this floor. Really? Seriously? Seriously. I don't even have to go over there and fight that bulbor. I will gladly take that. <laughs> oh man, I got scared for a second, but now I am slightly less scared because that was actually way easier than it than I thought it was going to be. Why that treasure was right in front of the exit, which I could have easily accessed right from the start of the cave, I will never understand. But whatever works. Alright, looks like we've got a good amount of fire on this floor, so... <sighs> I'm kind of afraid to leave most of my Pikmin alone in a cave like this, because there could be bull bears, and that worries me. Because they don't sleep. <sighs> okay, I guess I'll start exploring with these with these reds and uh, hopefully I don't want to wake up that bulb orb that could be bad um, hmm. how do I want to go about this I guess I'll start by just kind of periodically checking on Louie and the other Pikmin every once in a while and I'll go around and clear the uh, fire out of the way here I really want that to be able to get away from the bulb, uh, the uh, dwarf orange bulb orbs, because if I remember correctly, the orange bulb orb babies can wake up the mother, and that worries me greatly. Come here, come here, buddy. I just want you to. That's it. That's it. No. Okay. Don't. Okay. Good. Keep. If you're gonna walk, walk that way. Good. Good. Okay. You're dead. Just gonna try to one-shot these guys. Shit, shit, don't wake it up, don't wake it up, don't wake it up. <sighs> now the question is, do I want to bum rush that thing, or do I want to just throw rapidly? I think the better course of option in this scenario is to go get all of my, um, purples and just kind of throw rapidly, because then that does have a chance of stunning him, and that will make it slightly easier. But, wait, are there any more... Hmm, uh, I'm worried about fiery bulblaxes too, that also kind of worries me. Um, Louie, you're fine. I'll just leave you guys there for now. Olimar, you could take this back path. There's this one red leaf Pikmin. I'm going to carry him because he walks way too slow for my comfort. Come on, don't, guys, don't trip. Don't trip. That's, that's dumb. Oh, shit, he's facing right this way, so this is not a good path to take. I love how the Pikmin's legs are just kind of dangling there. It just kind of looks funny to me. All right. Now, the question is, if I go around this way, is that the same bulb orb from over there? Is it? Let me check the map. I don't think it is. Uh, do I really want to take these Pikmin out further? Uh, I'm kind of scared to do it, but... Alright. You know what? This orange bulb orb is the only one there. I'm gonna go for it. Let's get my purples out right now. Let's go ahead and stun you right away. Good, 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 good. Okay, now just beat it to death. Beat it to death. That went well. That went very well. I will just... One purple carry you back, because I don't really care how long it takes you. Um... Is that all of my reds right... Okay, no. Uh, Olimar has a few. Uh, crap. I forgot to turn my the volume down on my Wii remote, didn't I? I feel like that might be causing sound in the mic, and I should probably fix that. Okay, hold on a second. I'm gonna I'm go ahead and... Okay, I'm gonna turn that down now. Okay. Louie, you can take the reds, because I saw more fire over there. There's more dweebles. 
I don't want to get the attention of the bulb orbs. That's worrying me. No, don't, guys, stop digging. That's not what I want you to do right now. Just get you guys over on this side. Dweevil, come here, buddy. Come here, Dweevil. Okay, fine, I'll come. No, 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 no. Don't go that way. Don't go that way. Come here. Come here. Get, get, come this way. Why do I have a white Pikmin with me? Go away. I guess I'll have you guys start digging while I'm waiting for this Dweevil to come nearby. Because there's really nothing else for you to do. What I'm really worried about is that freaking orange Bulbor, because he's so close to the other enemies. No, no, he looked like he was about to come our way, but he didn't. I don't want to get too close and wake it up. So, the thing is, Bulborbs in this game are not that- Hey, no, 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 stop that. What the hell do you think you're doing? I'm gonna have to ask you to refrain. That is mine. No, no, bad. That is mine. That belongs to me, goddammit. Stop taking it. That's mine. Just kill the- Guys, no, guys, kill the Dweevil. Kill the Dweevil, please. No, guys, stop it! Kill the Dweevil! There you go. Okay, now, how hard was that? White Pikmin, go away! I don't want you right now. Okay, good. The Dweevil's over here. The Dweevil's over here. Ah, uh, shit. The Bulbor noticed me! Oh, wait. Oh, it didn't. Okay, then. Just gonna try to- SHIT! Oh, god damn it! No, 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 no! It was going so well! It was going so well! And then it fucked up. Oh, god damn it. I lost some Pikmin. I guess, at the very least, I was gonna say it lured him away, but it didn't. Alright, white Pikmin, go over here. I guess I'll just do that again. Uh, shit, 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 go, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, okay. Gather all my Pikmin, get them away from the bulwark, make sure that it goes away. Turn around. Good. Okay, now I guess I'll come rendezvous with these guys. Uh, shit, actually, that fire geyser might be a problem. Please don't wake it up. Please, for the love of God, don't- No, 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 I didn't want my white to do it. Don't wake it up. Don't wake it up. Okay. This is going well. I've only lost two Pikmin so far. Come on, just die quickly, die quickly. Come on. Yes. Perfect. Oh, okay, that actually went pretty goddamn well. I am not gonna complain there. Let's have you guys... I'll have some purples take this, actually. Just so you can kind of get started on that. Why are you going that way? Where are you? Okay, why did I, why you did a little loop around there is beyond me. But whatever, whatever you think is okay. You guys can get on this. Um, I'll leave Olimar here just so he's closer to the exit. And oh my God, that's a lot of Pikmin over there. All right. Uh, is this a brooch of some kind? I don't know. It looks pretty. Eternal Emerald Eye. Pretty. I like. I have a feeling that this is the last treasure. It looks like it is. Swarm you guys. Oh wait, you don't know. You already have six on you. I'll just swarm the rest of you guys onto this. Most of my white Pikmin are in the front, so that'll definitely make it go faster. Alright, so you guys... I guess we're pretty much just waiting for the skull to get back. Alamar, go wait by the exit. There's a fire geyser here, but nobody cares. Come on, guys, hurry up. We're just waiting on you. There we go. Why this is down here, I don't know, but okay then. Colossal fossil. Clever. And yep, that was it. Okay, let's delve deeper. A uh, random question. What animal skull was that? I, I'm, like, really into animals, but I, I can't identify them based on their remains. So, yeah. If anybody knows what that is, let me know. I'm interested. Final floor. 
I see you over there. Don't act like I can't see you over there. I know who you are. Okay, then. Let's go ahead and get these fire geysers out of the way first and foremost. Don't, don't look at me like that. I know you're there. I'm not stupid. I know you're there. Okay. Appears that that's the only thing here. I don't want my white- I do not want my whites and my purples over there. I really don't. That could be bad. I'll leave you guys here for now. Hey, don't I know you from somewhere? Yep, that's Emperor Bulblax from Pikmin 1, the final boss. He's just a normal boss in this game. But yeah, he's a lot smaller and actually a lot less dangerous. But, um... What? I mean, I know he was less dangerous, but that was kind of pathetic. <laughs> Damn. It looks fascinating, but it's drenched in that creature's internal- Ew, that's nasty. Oh, don't roll your eyes at me. I'll store it for you. Damn, Emperor Wallblacks, I know that you're not the same one, and you probably, uh, haven't exactly been working out in your downtime, but... Damn! That was way easier than I expected it to be. I always remembered this guy putting up at least a little bit of a fight, but... That was nothing. That was really, really easy. Oh, shit. Shit. I just realized I don't have blue Pikmin, and there's a puzzle up ahead. There, there's water there, and you technically don't need them, but having them makes them makes this puzzle a billion times easier. Forged courage. It kind of looks like a transformer. This material has perplexing properties. I will try fusing it with this spare spacesuit. Processing complete. Success. Behold my latest invention, the Scorch Guard. Thanks to the heat-resistant alloy, this suit is now impervious to fire. Very helpful indeed. Okay, I'll have you guys start on this wall, I guess. And I will go get my reds, because I know for a fact I need them up here. And I also want to point out that sometime between the last five seconds and now, the ship has already infused our suits that we are currently still wearing with the fire-resistant alloy. Um, how it did this in the span of about two seconds is beyond me, but okay. Alright, I just want my reds for this. Because there is a puzzle that involves... Ah, uh, god damn it, I... I remember this being a real pain in the ass without blue Pikmin, and I'm... There's part of me that's tempted to just leave the cave, skip all the floors again, and come back with blues and do it that way, but I feel like that's, that's just cheap, and I'm not gonna do it. Also... This puzzle would just be straight up skippable if you could throw captains in this game. Because you could just throw somebody up on that ledge. Alright. Uh, I guess I'll start by throwing... Three should be fine. The... How do I want to do this? Can Olimar punch these things away? Oh. I'm an idiot. I could just walk up. No, 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 guys, guys, just, just the whites. Um, I remember having to take out those fire geysers over there, but apparently not. Let's go ahead and just throw all of my white Pikmin up here, just because it'll go a lot faster this way. And I could just whistle them from here. And this is probably going to light some of them on fire, but you know what? I could just whistle them and it's not a big deal. Okay. Come on, guys. Just just beat it. No, 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 no. Don't fall into the water, please. That would be bad. I really... No, 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 no! God damn it. He drowned. No, 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 no! Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Guys, guys. Did it seriously not show me this cutscene until just now? That's kind of surprising to me, but okay. Yes, yes, I know, I know. I can whistle them safe. 
Okay, come on, come on, come on. I know that one Pikmin is going to drown, but there's he can't be saved at this point. There's no way I can get him back. Why did I- uh, God damn it, another Pikmin fell off a cliff. I probably shouldn't have had Whites do this, to be honest, but whatever. Whites are kind of- are kind of sparse, but... Uh, uh, why did I do it this way? I'm an idiot. Why did I- I did not think this through. I really did not think this through. Okay, Fire Guys is dead. Let's go ahead and just get you guys on this. No, 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 no! Okay. I thought they were going to go down, but they didn't, and that's good. I'll leave you guys here for now because it really doesn't matter. Almar, you can just wait here. Louie. I guess you could just check up on these guys. Um, I think that's all this floor has, to be honest. Just waiting for you guys to get back. Also, is that a gyroid? It looks like a gyroid from Animal Crossing. I don't know. I haven't played an Animal Crossing game. Oh, that's actually not true. I played New Leaf for like five minutes one time on my friend's 3DS, but... I, I never actually, like, actually played it. Yeah, it is a gyroid. Cool. Okay. That was easier than anticipated, but I will take it. I will gladly take that. And, tell you what, that's actually going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been the Play Commander, and be sure to tune in next time for more Let's Play Pikmin 2, where we go back to the surface and possibly start another cave. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Actually, I think that's it. I think we're done with the Awakening Woods. <laughs> wow. Okay, then. I'll take it. I will gladly take it. But yeah. Anyway, see you guys next time. Actually, before I end this video, I just want to make sure that that's all there is to do here. 80% of debt recovered. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care is there's no more treasures on the ground I think we're doing pretty damn good